Hi, I'm Tim Hawkins, the CEO of the Community Action Agency of Butte County, and I want to take a minute to thank our Red Cross Adaptation Team. Our mission at Community Action is to improve the economic security and well-being of low-income residents of Butte County through diverse housing, human service programs, and community collaborations. We do this by providing utility assistance, weatherizing the homes of vulnerable families, providing transitional housing to homeless families with children, by providing food to organizations in an 8,000 square mile area that feed our struggling Northern California neighbors, and by mobilizing volunteers to transport food donations from food retailers to nonprofits to save perfectly good food from going to waste. We do this through a custom built app called the 530 Food Rescue Coalition. When I became CEO in 2022, I knew I needed to strengthen our relationships with other community-based organizations to leverage my organization talents with the resources of other organizations with parallel missions. On the heels of COVID, I felt disconnected because I'd gone so long without gathering with other organizations. And with impeccable timing, the community adaptation team reached out to discuss forming a resiliency collaborative. In short order, this Red Cross team was instrumental in pulling together leaders from uh, over 80 organizations to form and support the Butte Resilience Collaborative. They've also been a huge support in the Butte County Food Systems Collaborative and have found significant ways to bridge barriers that were identified. For instance, uh, a serious shortage of cold storage at many nonprofits were limiting their ability to receive food from the 530 Food Rescue Coalition. In short order, the Red Cross team was purchasing refrigerators for dozens of these organizations. And that relatively small thing has opened the gates for unconventional partners like affordable housing apartment complexes to stand up food pantries and receive food to assist their residents in making them more resilient. The community adaptation team helped increase the capacity of other organizations by helping them install solar thereby permanently reducing their ongoing operating costs and making them more resilient when the next disaster strikes. And they've been instrumental in figuring out who's doing what in the community and connecting organizations together to form partnerships to better serve communities in both blue skies and when disaster strikes, making the entire community more resilient. Nate, Jake, and Amalia have embodied the tenets of servant leadership by working to lift others up and support the growth of a wide range of organizations and share credit for the many successes their team has spurred. I'm happy to not only call them partners, but also my friends.